Well, hey there, team, and welcome back to the channel, and welcome to Space Choice Data Analyzer. Bit of a mouthful. So, depending on how these all go up on the channel, um, this is by Silver Dollar Games, and I just dug out One Finger Death Punch 2, which you can see is being advertised on the screen. That's right, these guys made that, which is one of my favorite games of all time, and I was covering it because they made this which released overnight, and it's free on Steam. You can go and download it now and check it out. So um, I'm very, very pumped. One of my favorites, really ultra indie developers, and it's their newest game, and I just accidentally found out about it. So very, very cool. Um, so what is this game? As I can understand it, it's sort of this pitched battle, almost like an auto battler, funnily enough, my current favorite genre of uh, your fleet versus their fleet. Um, and as the match goes on, it's basically a, a stress times 10,000 simulator as I see it. It keeps popping up these choices that you need to make and um, you get like a couple of seconds and it just never stops. It's relentless. You've got to choose, choose, choose. And this ultimately starts putting more ships into the fleet, more weapons and firepower as the battle rages on. Sim seems simple enough, seems stressful enough, seems very much like their catalog. So we're going to have a bit of a look at this now. Select difficulty. Let's go with normal. Straight into it. Let's go. Pick one of the three options. Pick one of the three options. Eagles, longship, or defenders. Right? I don't know. Eagles. Right? And then advanced beam, rapid cannon, fighter, def I don't know what any of this is. Anti-fighter, ignore shields. Okay, cool. This so is this... The time you have before your next choices are ready. Yep. There's a the little ship that came in that I spawned. Energy weapons such as lasers and beams hit shields before a ship's health. Energy weapons hit shields first. Okay. Physical weapons like cannons, rockets, missiles, and bullets ignore shields and damage the ship directly. Ignore shields. Fighters are fast and can dodge slow-moving projectiles like cannon shells and rockets. Uh, 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 rocket upgrade. Defense weapons shoot physical projectiles like cannon shells, rockets, bombs, and bullets, but they can't shoot down energy weapons. Um. Repair beams heal health and have great range. Fighters, with their speed, can draw enemy fire away from the main fleet. Brigade escort, escort. A beam. Uh, weak missiles. Let's go. Ship's weaponry for a brief time. I believe we've got this little dude defending back here. Oh no, no, he's attacking. Get out of here. Um, bullet double, bullet double damage. Let's go. Uh, scorpions. Shock ship. That sounds cool. Uh, uh fighter defense laser. Oh, we do uh, probably. Okay, yep. Okay. DPS profile upgrades. Okay, that's cool. Thunderbolt fighter, let's get some fighters in. With beams. There it is there. Oh look, they got little little dudes. Mothership gun, okay, whatever. So this is we're gonna have to play this game to figure out what's going on. You know, learn by doing. Battleship, yes, I want that. Uh laser cannon. Where's my battleship? There look at this. Look at this monster. Boss incoming! get stronger over time so try to defeat them as quickly look at him possible. he's huge oh, lightning fighters yes more presently, lightning fighters uh beam anti-fighter no in incorrect negative rare ship nice uh, uh damage all ships oh jesus nice all right let's go oh hang on I get to choose one of these. Mothership life. Permanently increase mothership life. Shield regen. Uh, let's go shield regen. Choose level. Oh! Enemy fleet is equipped with energy weapons. With point defense. Enemy fleet is many larger ships with laser weapons. Let's go point defense because... Wait, well that would be more about missiles, wouldn't it? Battle cruiser. I want a battle the cruiser. Let's go. Point defense weaponry. Uh, 
Oh, I had to reset reset everything. Juggernaut. Hunter, well, missiles probably aren't a great idea because they've got point defense, right? Point defense doesn't stop lasers. Okay, that's thank you, thank you, lady. Can we increase stun damage, increase ships, shields, shields of larger ships? There we go. They're gonna blow my ship up back there. Battle, battle, uh, destroyer. Let's get a destroyer. Uh, advanced beam. Oh no, their, their fighters are a problem, aren't they? Okay, hang on. Sentry. Rockets. Uh, advanced, advanced beam. Let's go. Physical projectiles will bypass a ship's shields. Physical projectiles will bypass. Rocket damage double. Heal 50. Heal the ships. Make yeah. Make sure you pick ships with a lot of health. Shields are not as important here. Shields are not as important here, are they? All right, Dreadnought. Lots of health works best against physical weapons like cannons. Bullets, Beam anti-fighter. There's my Dreadnought. Very good. Um, Corvette. Life. Uh, Corvette. Uh, yeah, anti-fighter. Oh, yeah. Bullet upgrade, fighter, large ship shield upgrade. Let's go. Um, uh, hammer. Uh, Anti-fighter. Uh, uh, dreadnought. Uh, ignore shields. Let's go. Four fast picks. Yeah, let's go. Um, eagles. Homing missiles. Let's go. Uh, gunboats. Short beam. Yeah, all right, let's go. Uh, uh, beam upgrade. Yes. Dreadnought hammer. Defen defenders, maybe? Beam? He's got so much point defense. Starfighters. Uh, ignore shield. Upgraded tracking. Recharge all shields. Keep pouring it on. Let's go. Fighters, gunboats. Let's just go little shit fighters, yeah? Cannon. Oh, here they come. Star fighters, dodge slow shots, cannon. Jeez, look at this damage saturation, stop. Uh, nuclear upgrade, what is that? I'll take it. Gunboats, scorpions, let's get that. Uh, short range. Um, long ship. Look at that, it's yellow. That's cool. Oh, get out of here. Um, permanently increase mothership's life. Shields. Let's go life. Nice. Choose level. Cool, here we go. Fleet remaining. This enemy has no fighters. Enemy fleet has many fighters. Enemy fleet is balanced and has bullet weapons. Let's go no fighters. I like this. I like this a lot. Um, uh, long ship. Fleet has no fighters. Rockets. Let's go. You won't need any anti-fighter weapons. Uh, let's get star fighters. You should avoid all short-range weapons unless the enemy is directly on top of your fleet. Avoid short-range weapons unless they're on top of our Fighters fleet. Fighters don't worry okay. about rangers. They can fly right up to the target. Um, always attack at short range. Uh, 
Uh, rig it. Very long. Laser double damage. Damage all ships. Stuff them. Long ship. Uh, eagles. Very long. A beam upgrade. We're kind of popping them, to be honest. Fire, yeah, 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 yeah. Rockets. Um, frigate uh, uh, escort. It's cool, I'm slowly beginning to uh, understand and memorize some of these things and what they are. Destroyer. Uh, advanced laser. Battleship. Laser cannon. Destroyer, heavy laser, gunboats, Jesus, got a few ships, ah, uh, full fast, oh, legendary pick I should have taken, ah, uh, uh, scorpion, Juggernaut, yes. Nice. Give me more mothership life. Let's go. All right, yes. I want to see where this difficulty loop goes. You know what I mean? Where's this going? Uh, enemy fleet is well balanced. Enemy fleet contains many fighters. Enemy fleet contains large ships with homing missiles. Many fighters. Let's go that. Let's try it that this time. All right. Intel shows the enemy has medium sized fighters. Okay. Medium sized fighters are typically slower moving, but armored and hearty. Anti fighter weapons are effective against medium sized fighters. Yeah, I would think so. Battle cruiser, destroyer, bugger. Oh yeah, bring in the boys, look at that. Lots of little fellas. Dreadnought. Rocket. Upgrade. Frigate long uh, sentry. Eagles long ship. Yeah, you know, slow, slow, slow point defense. Cruiser destroyer. Rockets cannon. As a viewer, where do you focus your attention? I'm telling you now, I'm only looking at the bottom of the screen myself.
Oh my god, all these fighters. Get out of here. Um... Regen allies shields, ah. Oh. Here comes this boss. Uh. God damn, so many fighters. <gasps> oh, no, that's right. That worked out well. Wiped them all. Nice. Uh, okay, permanently increase the mothership's shields. Shield regen. We'll just increase the life. Enemy fleet is balanced and has beam weapons. Enemy is equipped with long range bullets. Enemy fighters and stun weapons. Fleet is balanced and has beam weapons. Tell me more about that. Play this at your desk on lunch breaks for sure, man. I can see that. The enemy fleet is equipped with multiple beam weapons. So that means they're gonna zap my shields Energy a lot. Weapons such as beams are weak against shields. Mothership gun, let's go. Um. We have increased uh, beam damage. Oh yeah, that'll do.
Um, mini nuke, eh? This one. You can see it there. There's the nuke there coming. Increased beam damage. Come on, boys, hold it down. Well, this is starting to get a tad overwhelming, isn't it? The air is starting to overwhelm me a bit. <laughs> Uh, oh my god, this is getting insane. Push back, Ben. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this game had too many energy drinks, so like, I can see that. <laughs> oh, this is definitely zany, hey. That's cool. Uh, so it, it does make me wonder where, where how the depth develops. It's obviously, you know, very, it's very bare bones, basic. Like, it's solid for what it does. But um, I do need to... Um, well, if you're playing a roguelike or whatever, you, you know that you need to sort of memorize the loot table and all that to a certain point. Um, and I think that's what needs to happen here, is that I need to basically learn what all the different ships and that sort of do and how you can leverage that as well. Very cool. But, um, yeah, like I said, it's free to play. If you uh, are curious, just go and download it on the store. Very zany, very, very off the walls, very stressful, but I, you know, I really like it, actually. Anyway, team, thanks again for joining me. I might just leave it there for the time being, and I'll catch you guys on the next one.